and deep inside, very juicy, very sweet, and inside is the embryo. That's it, fruit, but right here is the embryo. And that'll actually grow out two plants. And you can see a lot of plants on the ground here too. Jabotacama really was one, is one of my favorite fruits here. Jabotacaba that's on Pyramid Family Farm. And about 30 years ago, maybe 32 years ago, I got a couple trees from a nursery. I didn't even know what they were. I was just planting everything and it was called Jabotacaba. I planted it and it took about 15 years for it to make fruit. And this was the first tree I planted right here. And if you come up in here, we've harvested everything we could reach. Now we're going to have to harvest everything with a little bit of equipment. We're going to get these ladders next. But the flowers and fruits on the stem of the tree. This is related to Kamu Kamu, so it's high in vitamin C, vitamin A, 
it has this dark, dark, it's really dark like a grape, so I'm pretty sure it's high in resveratrol and all the astaxanthin kind of things that are the green, the red, red colors that are really healthy. And it tastes like a, a Concord grape. It's really juicy. And it's got a lot of, and inside here is a, what they call a seed, but it really isn't a seed, it's really an embryo. And it's really delicious. And it's not really a seed, it's already a plant. Actually, there's two plants right in here. Right inside that seed is two plants. So if you look on the ground, when the birds eat the jabotacaba, these are all little jabotacaba trees. And jabotacaba trees, right at this stage, they will do a video on it. This is an excellent bonsai type plant. This is jabotacaba, it's probably about three or four years old. This can be pulled up, cut back like a, like a bonsai, and in 15 years, you'd have a teeny little plant with these big, big fruits. But this jabotacaba, I was so excited by it, I was so excited by jabotacaba. In this polyculture of coffee, avocados, citrus, you can see there's lemons up here. It's a good jungle here in South Kona. I planted another 60 trees from the seeds off of this tree, and that was about 15 years ago. So now we're gonna walk up and go look at some trees that are just setting fruit now for the first time. If you look over here, from the birds and just eating jabotacaba, here's, a, here's about a 10 year old tree that basically planted itself. And after it, was, after it started growing, we put rocks around it and we said, okay, you're gonna be a tree. And there's another tree there. So this is actually gonna become a jabotacaba orchard uh, pretty soon. Just, just from, I didn't even plant this, it's just from a seed that a bird fell across. Oh, that's...